What's up troopers, my name is Neon, today we're going to be talking about the suppressors. There's multiple suppressors in this game, but which one should you be using? Before we get into the video, if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, of course leave a like, thank you very much. So there is multiple suppressors in the game, you have the PB Heavy Suppressor, you have the Type 4 Heavy Suppressor, you have the 6KU Suppressor, and you actually have the Wrap Suppressor. Let's start off with the PB Heavy Suppressor. This is actually with most of the default weapons, especially with the M16A3. This is something actually you shouldn't be really using. Like, this is something where you think, oh, it'll be pretty good, it'll make the suppressor a lot more better, but it actually really doesn't at all. Yes, you get that suppressed sound, stealth and minimap and all that, but you lose a huge chunk of range and you lose that project velocity. You lose firepower and it's 5% of that. You also lose accuracy of 5% and you lose range up to 8%. That is pretty mad. So we're not going to be using that one at all. The next one is the Type 4 Heavy Suppressor. And oh boy, this is something you shouldn't even be using at all. Did you guys know that this actually takes 8% of damage away from your weapon? 8% of damage, that is pretty bad. So imagine like you was actually doing a really good weapon, you actually had some good high damage, and you're losing 8% of that damage. That is pretty wild. You also lose 5% of accuracy and lose 5% of range. It basically gives you the same benefit as all the other suppressors. But this one here, you're losing the most damage out of all of them. The next one is the 6KU suppressor. With this one, you're not actually losing that much with it. Yes, you are losing a little bit of damage, and you are losing a little bit of accuracy but really except that you're not losing that much at all the only thing's negative with this attachment is the range the range is a little bit more effective with it so you just got to be careful on how you use it i know troopers i'm just teasing you guys i just want to go all the way to the end and just show you the best suppressor the best one is the wrap suppressor reason why i say the wrap suppressor is the best one out of all of them well this one is the only suppressor in the game like the only suppressor in the game what does not lose any damage at all it would literally be the same if you switch to the champion muzzle break and you switch back to the wrap suppressor you can switch so many different attachments and then go back to this suppressor and you will literally nothing would change whatsoever and that's what's so good about the suppressor you don't lose any damage whatsoever the only things you do lose is you do lose a little bit of accuracy so you have to consider that when it comes to assault rifles especially and you also have to consider it when it comes to that range as well you really got to figure out what you really want to be using this for personally for me i feel like using the suppressor maybe even like a d DMR. You could be pretty sneaky, but the thing is though, with a DMR, you're considering more long range distance and you're only stealth up to the minimap by 40 meters. So I don't consider using something like a DMR to use. What about an LMG? Well, an LMG could be close, but it's usually used more in long distance. So that is something you probably need to consider. But then when it comes to sight rifles, sight rifles, you definitely can do it because how the weapons perform right now, you're not always having them long distance gunfights. So actually having gunfights up to or under 40 meters is a really good situation honestly troopers i feel like the go-to for using that suppressor is actually in the smg class you could be using it for the pbx honestly you can use it for the pb29 absolutely amazing for the pb29 i know a lot of people love the mp9 to use it for honestly troopers i highly recommend you guys should be using the wrap suppressor it's very important i suggest you should be using it as your second part on the left side of the tree so you have like a really good muzzle and then you use that suppressor also troopers if you ever use the p90 never use that default suppressor and it's probably the worst suppressor i've ever seen you literally lose like 10 percent of damage i'm not even going to talk about it i'm just saying if you ever use the p90 do not use that suppressor if you use that gun it will turn into a roblox weapon trust me anyway troopers that's all about the suppressors so i just want to give you a breakdown on which ones are the best suppressors to use and out of all of them it's the wrap suppressor so if you haven't used it then i highly recommend you guys should anyway troopers thank you very much for listening to me talk if you did enjoy the video don't forget to leave like comment subscribe be a part of pink wagami i'll see you troopers in the next video. Peace.